Hey St Clements, this is day three and today we're learning all about Sir David Attenborough. Sir David Attenborough is a television presenter but he's more than that. He's an author, he's um, a, a television producer but he's also really really significant in in how we think about protecting our planet and protecting the animals on this planet. There is a video on the Newsround website which would be really good to watch. Um, it, it demonstrates Sir David Attenborough's life um, and here he is and his life on film and the work that he's done on the BBC. So magnificent man Sir David Attenborough and so today we're thinking about him but we're also thinking about our planet and specifically we're probably thinking about animals as well. I'd like to show you the Edinburgh Zoo website. So the Edinburgh Zoo website looks like this and over on the Edinburgh Zoo bit, you can have a look at what's going on and you can click on to have a look at the things that are that are live. Now, I just clicked here a second ago and here we go. Here are the meerkats. Now, I love the meerkats. Meerkats are really, really cool animals. So there's the meerkats you could look at. There's also the lemurs. When I looked a minute ago, there was a lemur down by the camera. Oh, there he is. Look at that. Oh, he's gonna fall, he's gonna fall. No, he's all right. That's a ring-tailed lemur. They're very cool, very, very cool. There's another one, right over the top. So that's some of the things that, uh, that we're gonna look at today. So we're gonna think about animals, but we're also going to be thinking about writing. Now, as I said, I do like meerkats. And so we're gonna think about doing some writing about meerkats. Well, I am, but I'd like you to write about your favourite animal or an animal you like. So I'd like you to have a look at, find out some animals, find out some information, maybe watch something on, on, on YouTube if your parents are with you, or look at some books. They're really, really good ways of finding out about them. Now, I did a bit of research about meerkats, and we're going to write our, our, um, our things about meerkats just now using this. We're going to write them with a subject the verb and a bit more. So the subject in this case is going to be the meerkats. So I'm going to write meerkats. Now I need to the verb and that's a doing word. So meerkats, they, so meerkats eat because that's something they do. Meerkats eat and they eat insects and animals, whoops, animals in the ground. Hmm, interesting. I'm going to have another go. Me so subject, so that's meerkats, meerkats, oops, cats. You'll obviously write this. I'm having to type it because you can't see me if I write it. So meerkats. Now, they live together as family. So my verb there is live. So meerkats live in family groups. Full stop. There we go. I'm going to write another sentence as well. I know that meerkats live underground as well they live in tunnels and things underground so i'm going to write that meerkats live same verb again meerkats live underground and i'm going to write a bit more in tunnels full stop <gasps> brilliant so that is my writing for today so perhaps you could have a go at doing some writing all about an animal you like and you could let me know send them send me a photo that would be i'd love to see it Uh, I'm just waiting now to look for what else it is that we've got to do today. What else was it that we were going to talk about today? So please do see if you can find something to read about an animal. An animal you like would be really good. Um, do try and write something. Perhaps you can draw a picture of your animals. Perhaps you could make yourself a little book. That would be amazing. St. Clements, have a really good day. I hope you're well. See you soon. Bye-bye.